Hello, my dear friends. All right, y'all. It is monthly Bible giveaway time again, and this is so much fun for me, and I pray that somebody that needs a good Bible wins. I'll, I'll be happy whoever wins, but if, if you need a good Bible and don't win, send me an email. I'll talk to Santa Claus and see if he can maybe come early for you. I'm not a rich man, but everybody needs a, a good Bible to read, y'all. That There's nothing like holding God's Word in your hands. It's almost as good as holding, giving a hug to God Himself. But anyway, here is the rules. Several days ago, and I don't remember how many days ago, three or four or five days ago, I did a video. I don't even remember, I, I don't have a clue what the video was about. But in the middle of that video, I held up a book and told you it was a very good book. I, I held it up so you could see the name of it on the front like that. Tell me what that book was. The first one to answer correctly will win this month's Bible. And the Bible is just like this one. Just exactly like this one. It's a King James Version, thin line, reference edition, has the gilded edges, has the uh, word, words of Christ in red. It, it's a good, good Bible. It uh, back, back in the back, it's got this key, key Bible promises, and it's got a parables of the New Testament concordance to the King James Version. It's got all kind of good stuff in it. And it is leather. It's got a leather cover. Unfortunately, it's only in black, so I hope you like black. Oh, and it's got the little ribbon here, too. So, and I don't, I don't remember when it was. It was, I would say, within the last week I did that video, and the video was not about the book that I held up. I just happened to have the book laying on my desk here and I picked it up and showed you the front of it like that and said it was a good book or something to that effect. And it's the only book I've picked up and showed you in that manner before and it was not a Bible. So y'all, whoever watched the video, you probably know what book it was already. And you can answer me just like that. If you didn't watch it, then you got to go back and watch my videos for the last few days to a week, I would say, and find wherever in that video. And I don't remember if it's at the beginning of a video or in the middle or at the end. I don't remember. I just remember holding it up. But whoever tells me the name of that book first will win. And I'm excited about this. And I'll have it shipped direct to your house from the uh, Christian Book ChristianBooks.com, I think is the name of the company. That's where I buy all of my Bibles and all of my uh, Christian books at. I've, I've bought from them for years, for, uh, from them for years, and I, I like them a lot. I've got another book ordered for me from there. And it left on March 4th. And it was supposed to have been here on March 10th. And it hadn't got here yet. It got all the way to Kansas City. And then it turned around and went back to the town it came from. <laughs> so, so I don't know what the heck's going on. But that that's United States Postal Service. And for this Bible I'm giving away and for anything else I buy from them, I am going to pay the extra and have FedEx deliver it. 
because I, you know, the last few orders I got from them, the USPS took forever to get delivered. So I'm just, I'm not going to use them for these purchases anymore. All right, that's it, y'all. Uh, a recent video, and I, I don't remember how recent. I know it wasn't yesterday, and it wasn't today. But I don't remember how far back it was. I held up a book as I was doing my video. I don't remember what I said about the book. I just said it was a good book or something like that. And it's not a Bible. First one to see, and it's the only book I've held up in a long, long time, except for my Bible. And usually I'm just holding my Bible like this reading to you. Except when I got this new Bible, I showed it. And last month's giveaway, I think I held up a Bible and showed you what I was giving away. But it's not a Bible. It's a different kind of a book. First one of y'all to tell me the name of that book and the video that it was in, and you'll be the winner. All right? Easy. If you watch my videos, you would know, and you could answer me immediately. So we'll see how long it takes somebody to get their correct answer. And I'm excited. I hope y'all are too. And uh, So that's that for now. I've got a couple more videos I need to make. Uh, my friend Michael hadn't talked to me in uh, since yesterday. And just a few minutes ago, or maybe an hour ago now, he made some requests for y'all. So I'll do my autistic buddies video that he likes me to do every day and I'll do that and then I'll be back for the daily Bible readings later today I'm tired y'all I got so much pain I went out for lunch and I, I was busy here this morning when I woke up this morning I felt good and I got busy doing stuff and I reckon I did too much <laughs> It was 2 o'clock, or it was 1.45 when I left home. And uh, there's only two restaurants. Well, there's four restaurants here. Three of them I won't go to. <laughs> so, so that leaves me with one place to eat besides here at home. And I, I've been cooking a lot lately, and I wanted, I didn't feel like cooking today. So I went to the restaurant here in town that I'll eat at. And they close at two. And I got there at like 1:50, and she, she saw me walk in. She said, "Oh, I just cleaned the grill." And I, I said, "That's all right." I said, "I'll go buy some bread and make a peanut butter jelly sandwich." And she said, "No, no, no. Come on, I'll cook for you." And so I ordered a hamburger, and I. Hamburger and fries. I said, I'll, I'll clean the grill for you. And she said, No, I said, it hamburger won't mess it up too bad. So I got me a hamburger and fries, and it was after two o'clock when she finished cooking. So I told her, and they, they wanted me to sit down there and eat. And I said, No, I said, I don't want to keep y'all past your going home time. So they put it in a to go bag for me, and I brought it home and ate it here. And it was good too. Well, they know how to cook there. I tell you what, their food might not be the healthiest in the world, but it sure is good. And that might be part of my problems, because I eat there a lot. But anyway, uh, and that burger, was, and I didn't finish it all either. I finished all the burger, but I didn't finish all the fries. And I'm still stuffed, and that was the uh, four hours ago and I'm still stuffed so I probably won't eat tonight but that's it for now y'all I got two more videos to make so let me get this one uploading and I'll come back and make another one and get it uploading then I'll come back and make the last one I already did two or three this morning already uh, it's been a busy video day and it's not over yet I love y'all I appreciate y'all leave me lots of thumbs up and if it just tickles your gizzard you can give me a thumbs down I don't care 
and give me a comment, say howdy, ball head, or something like that, and share it. If you ever see a good video here, share it on your social media or wherever you share stuff. I would appreciate it. I know several of you do, and it's showing a whole lot of shares, and I got no idea where most of them are going. You know, I, I get notifications of some of the shares, but I'm not getting notifications on all of them because it's showing a, in the stats, it's showing a whole lot more shares than what I'm getting notifications for. So whoever's sharing them, I do appreciate it a lot. And I, I occasionally share videos too. If y'all check my community page, I do everything that YouTube has. I do the YouTube shorts, I do the YouTube regular videos, and I do the community page. And I shared a video there this morning I think I don't remember what it's about but I liked it so I shared it and I share videos there occasionally and share all kind of memes there but that's it for now y'all I just I love Jesus and that's what my YouTube channel is about sharing Jesus and I'll be back shortly with more videos to glorify Jesus and share him with the world. Alrighty. See y'all later. God bless you. And good good luck to y'all on finding out what that book is that you need to be looking for. It's out there somewhere. <laughs>